When you come across screenplays that you know have, uh, that you and you can feel the power of them the way I did when I read the episode written by Rath Green, I read episode five of Genius, you do kind of get the bug. You get it very quickly, you get bit. And I remember that feeling ha happening very often whenever I read Game of Thrones scripts, and particularly when I got the script through from, uh, for uh, episode 10, I was, uh, I was somewhat uh, enthralled for Game of Thrones as to how I was going to have such a sticky ending, but I loved it. And when I read episode five, I mean, Rath Green had, has done something with it. He's told a story for my particular character as Edward Einstein, a story of a young man suffering from schizophrenia, a mental health issue which um, is, was in its pioneering years of being actually understood and treated in the most horrible way. Of course, it's so rich you can't, you can't not. I mean, you start salivating at the mouth practically. So as far as uh, screenwriting goes, it was wonderful, absolutely wonderful. I think it's that sense of authenticity. It's just very, um, it can't really be described or intellectualized. You just feel authenticity behind it, you know. And it doesn't even have to, it doesn't even have to be particularly heavy. It can be authentically comedic or authentically stupid or authentically slapstick or, you know, but it, if it has an authentic feel to it, you, you, you tend to pick it up. It's just a scent. And I, I, I felt it very strongly with this. Um, and, and, and alongside that, the writing of the way it was put on paper, the character itself was just absolutely wonderful. The story is so rich, um, you know, almost without even needing to be put on paper, but I'm glad that, they, that, that he did, because now we know a bit more about his son.